Hello everybody, we are back here on Bass Pro Shops The Hunt and in the last episode that we did, somebody in the comments was actually saying that if we go into the trophy room, we can see the legendary animals that we kill. And since we've never been here, I figured we would go ahead and do that. And it looks like it's also got all of the other animals as well. Uh, that's kind of cool. Let's see what we can actually look at. You can zoom in with the arrows. Wow, that's cool. That's awesome right there. And then we can go to the other trophies. There's a Weiser or Weezer. Then we got the alligator. Uh, over here we got... Ooh, we missed something there. Hmm, we're gonna have to go back and get it eventually. I'm not sure what it was. Uh, there's a 23 pound turkey. Uh, what else do we have? A uh, page up and page down. Okay, that goes to other regions apparently. There's our white-tailed deer. 227. There is our coyote. 21 pounds. Uh, the wolf. 147 pounds. That is our black-tailed deer. This one is 162 pounds. And there is our mule deer. 194 pounds. Um, I think that's it for here. Yeah, that's it for here. What else do we have? I think it's... Yeah, just this then. That's our elk. This is just a medium rack, seven or uh, six ninety-five. So we definitely could do better on that. Do we have anything else? Yes, we do. Okay, so we have the black bear, one hundred and four pounds. We have our bighorn sheep, which is one hundred and ninety-seven. We have iron head, which is the legendary. We got our duck that's 11 pounds and then that is a five pound rabbit and I think this probably is the last one mountain lion of 140 pounds um I could have swore there was another legendary that we missed or maybe one of the regions didn't have a legendary it's kind of looking like that's what it is um yeah nothing else to look at but I figured that was kind of cool so we at least got to take a look at it. Now it's time to jump into the next season hunt. So now we move on to Maine and this tournament's actually gonna be for moose. So this will be our first look at the moose, I believe. I don't think we've killed any as of now. So I'm kind of interested to see how this is gonna go. And then there should be a king of bucks there as well and hopefully a legendary. Welcome to Maine and the third day of the Bass Pro Shops Continental Classic. This state's rugged beauty provides an ideal home to some of the bigger game. Your goal today is to bring back a moose with the highest score. Good luck. So honestly, just from seeing that, the moose actually looked pretty decent. So I'm definitely excited to take some out. Let's uh, see what that is. Uh, that right there um, is a, where'd it go? I believe that's a raccoon. Yeah, I think it is. Yep, definitely a raccoon. Let's actually just take that out since we haven't took one. Just in case raccoons can actually be mounted in the trophy room. So there is indeed a legendary and a king of bucks. There's the uh, Noggles number 32. I think that's how you pronounce it. Probably not, but I guess good try. Uh, the coyote named Wiley. So, oh, that's funny. Wiley coyote. I get it. Um... Two black bear tags, four duck, and two moose. So yeah, we got two moose tags, two black bear. And then we gotta go for the king of bucks as well. Alright, easy enough. Well, there's a coyote. Um, let's go ahead and take that out. Because we can take as many of these as we want. They're not actually an animal that requires a tag. So we might as well take them. Try to get as much uh, reputation as we can. Oh, there we go. Ah, man, that thing might get away. I guess we're gonna have to uh, make better shots on these moose. They seem to be very strong. And as of now, the best thing we have is a 30-06, which seems to have issues taking them down in even two shots. So uh, we're gonna have to be very careful with our shot placement here. Oh my gosh, that scared me so bad.
I did not realize that there was a coyote that close, and that really took me by surprise when it showed up. Um, as far as this moose, I have no clue where it's even gone off to. I have yet to see any sign of it at all. Uh, we did just hear it, but it's hard to say where it is now since that coyote, uh, just happened to be walking in front of us and we ended up taking a shot on it. Who knows what happened to this moose. Ooh, there we go. There is another coyote. Let's go ahead and get this thing down. And that will be the end of it. You know, to be honest, I kind of like the coyotes in this game. I think they look pretty good. Uh, at the very minimum, they're at least better looking than Call of the Wild's coyotes. Uh, classics, I think, are still some of the best coyotes I've seen in a hunting game, but that was our moose. Where was that? It's got to be just around here. We got to be able to find it soon. It's definitely in this direction. It's called a couple more times, and I think we're very close. Uh, it's getting a little bit louder every time that it calls, and I think soon we should be able to see it. At least when we're in this crouch mode, it will kind of highlight animals, so hopefully that's going to help us with spotting this thing, because I'm not exactly sure where it could be around here. I just know that we've been hearing it quite a bit, and we're also hearing coyotes around us as well. Oh, oh no. Is this the encounter? Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> did that fill up a tag? I think it did. That counted. No, it, oh, oh wow. Okay, so it didn't count as our tag. But the score counted. That's actually kind of cool. I like that. So that saves us a tag on a moose. And I don't even think that was that big of a moose, to be honest. It was smaller than the one that we shot earlier. Hopefully we can find the one that we wounded, because I think that, that guy was bigger than the one that we just shot, and I mean, the one that we just killed gave us the lead, so if we can get this other one, we should be able to secure our lead even more. Oh, 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 there it is. Oh my gosh. I can't believe we just hit that shot. Did that give us a better score? No, it didn't. Wow. So that actually was not better than the one that we killed that attacked us. That's kind of surprising. Ooh, there we go. There is another coyote. Let's go ahead and take it out. Just like that, it's on the ground. We've been finding a ton of these little coyotes and a decent amount of moose as well, but I have yet to see a single black bear. Hopefully there's some black beer... Black beer? Wow. <laughs> oh, I can't speak properly. Uh, hopefully there's some black bear near. I'm not sure if there is, but we're going to keep searching and hopefully we can find one. And I think that since it's here, let's go ahead and take out this little rabbit. We just want to try and get as much uh, reputation as we can and hopefully just continuously improve our scores for each of these species for our trophy room. Well, we might actually be able to take out a few ducks here. I'm not entirely sure, but I think these uh, should be in range, hopefully. Most definitely was in range. Let's uh, try to get another. Uh, not going to happen, I don't think. At least Excellent. we got one of them. You've claimed your moose and earned enough rep to unlock Missouri. To get there, head to the map in the Bass Pro Shop store. Would you like to go now? Uh, no, I would not like to go now because we are going to continue looking for the legendary animal. So, uh, we're going to keep looking for it. And then I guess once we find it, we will just, uh, cut to that. But I did see that we actually unlocked the 3030 and the crossbow. So, I think in the next episode, we're actually going to use the 3030 and the crossbow and just see how they do. There is another raccoon. Let's, uh, take this one out with the bow. We honestly have not used the bow too much, so let's uh, get a little bit of use out of it. And just like that, we got ourselves a raccoon. Ooh, there we go. There is another moose. This will fill our moose tag. I think this one's actually a little bit smaller than the others, but we will still take it out. Uh, let's actually stand up for this. And just like that, we have took it out. Let's see if it improved our standing. No, definitely didn't. So I guess that's going to be the best thing that we can get moose-wise. 
Uh, we do have two black bear tags still, and then we also need to find Wily, so we'll keep searching for those. Hopefully we can find them. Well, there's a coyote. Let's go ahead and take that out. Definitely not Wily, but we might as well get all the coyotes down if we can, just to kind of narrow down the amount of possibilities whenever we hear a coyote. Hopefully eventually it'll get to a point where it's just Wily on the map, or hopefully we'll find him before that uh, period, but if it comes to it, I'd like to at least get all of the others eliminated as much as we can, and that is a coyote track again, range 490, jeez. Ah oh, man, I'm kind of disappointed that we don't have any moose tags left, because that's actually a big moose right there. That's a very big moose. I'm curious if there's a way to actually make it attack us so we can take it out, but I, I don't think there is, so we're probably just not going to be able to have it. Well, there's another coyote once again, not Wily. But man, we are getting a ton of these guys down, and I think that might actually be one of the biggest ones. I'm not entirely sure what the other ones have weighed, but that one looked much bigger. I don't know why, but uh, I guess hopefully it's bigger than the others that we've killed so we can get it in our trophy room. Oh my gosh, it's Wily. Hello there, buddy. Well, <laughs> we got him. That's uh, not how I was expecting that to go down, but I suppose that's uh, the end of him. And I still have yet to see a black bear this entire time of hunting here, so I don't even know if they exist on this map. I'm starting to wonder if maybe that's a bug, maybe it doesn't actually have black bear here. Because I've literally searched all of the map except for maybe like the right side, like the right middle. I guess that's like the only spot I haven't looked, but I doubt that there's going to be a black bear there, especially since I've searched almost the entire map and seen absolutely none. So. I think we're just going to go ahead and call it there. We got the target animal. Um, actually, no, no. Now that I think of it, we still need to look for the king of bucks. Uh, scratch that. I guess we're going to look around a little bit more. You know, just as I mention it, there's black bear tracks. Well, so apparently there is black bear on the map. They're just really elusive and hard to find. A lot like this king of bucks. Oh my gosh, finally. We finally got his attention. That was a very long time of not really seeing anything. Um, ever since we started looking for him, I think it's been like 20 minutes that have passed. So it's been quite a search to say the least. I'm just glad that he's finally getting close. Looks like he's right under a tree as well next to a coyote. So if we see the coyote, then we know where he is. And I think they're probably over here. Yep, yep, that's got to be them. That is two coyotes right there. And our buck is probably incredibly close to them. So let's just be really careful here. Try not to spook them. And then once we see him, we will get a shot on him. And there's also a black bear. You know, this explains why we could not find this guy. He is stuck, it seems. And that would uh, definitely make quite a bit of sense since we've been searching for a very long time and I've even gone through here a couple times I feel and didn't see him but I mean we finally have him right there so let's try to get a clear view of his rack before we shoot him I want to get as good of a look at him as we can and then we'll also take out this black bear of course we'd find a black bear finally as well look at that beauty though unfortunately he's kind of bugging out but Let's get him on the ground. There we go. He's finally down. What a beauty. Definitely not as insane as the last one that we took out, but this one is a typical, so I guess it's uh, bound to not look quite as crazy since all the others have been non-tips, but that's still a really good looking deer. And let's uh, see if we can get that down as well, and... No, we need to reload right when I've got this bear in my sights. There we go. Wait. Wait, what? Oh, you're not allowed to shoot female large game. Ah, uh, it's unfortunate. Good thing that was just a warning. <laughs> to be honest, I didn't know that that was even a rule. 
Well, guess it's uh, time to head back to the uh, lodge. And just like that, we have a brand new addition to the King of Bucks, and it is a pretty good looking uh, typical. This is the first time we've actually got a typical buck for the King of Bucks, so I'm curious, how many do we have left? One, two, three, four, five, six. There's six of them left still, and it looks like at least two of them are typicals. Yeah, it looks like two of them are typical. Actually, three. So we have three typicals and three non-typicals left to find. That should be pretty awesome if we can get all of them. Uh, but I think we're going to go ahead and call it there. If you guys enjoyed, be sure to subscribe, click the like button, and ring that notification bell so you guys will never miss a video. Also, be sure to leave a comment down below on what you guys have enjoyed most about this series. It's really been a lot of fun, and I'm glad that a good majority of you guys have been enjoying this series as well. Because I gotta say, it's actually quite a bit of fun. I did not expect this game to be as fun as it is, and it's actually becoming one of my favorite uh, throwback series that we've done on this channel. And it's a game that I never actually got to play growing up. I played a lot of the Cabela's games when I was a kid, but never got around to playing this one. And I'm glad that I'm finally able to, and it's been a lot of fun. But I think, with that being said, I hope you all enjoyed, and we will be back in the next one. Peace!